Welcome back to CBS This Morning Saturday. Doctors are hoping stem cell therapy could be a weapon in the fight against coronavirus. On Friday, the company Mesoblast announced a 300-person trial to determine whether stem cell treatments will work in COVID patients suffering from severe lung inflammation. One hospital in New York tried it as an experiment with 12 patients, 10 of whom were able to come off of a ventilator. Adriana Diaz spoke with one of those survivors and the doctor leading that study. How do you feel now, Don Luis? ¿Cómo usted se siente ahora? Ahora me siento muy bien, muy bien. So you're feeling much better. Since being released from the hospital, 60-year-old Luis Naranjo prays every night over Zoom with his relatives back in Ecuador. It's a ritual the family started while he was hospitalized and fighting for his life. He was unconscious and on a ventilator for 14 days. How are you feeling? Very, very bad. Of course, I can breathe. Nothing. His daughter Paula took him to the ER, but like so many families struck by COVID, she couldn't go inside. When you dropped him off at the ER, I'm sure it crossed your mind that you might not see him again. It's one of the biggest guilt that I have because I forgot to tell him that I love him. I, all I said was, go inside. I hope you feel better. Oh my goodness. But you have him back. I have him back, yes. Doctors proposed a treatment used for other diseases like rheumatoid arthritis. They wanted to give him stem cells from bone marrow in hopes it would suppress severe lung inflammation caused by COVID. As he was getting the stem cell infusion, what was going through your mind? I was just hoping for him. Mount Sinai Hospital's Dr. Karen Osman led the treatment and is encouraged by the results in the initial group of 12 patients. What we saw in the very first patient was that within four hours of getting the cells, a lot of her parameters started to get better. How do you know that these patients getting off the ventilator wouldn't have already gotten off the ventilator had they not gotten the stem cells? We don't know and we would never dare to claim that it was related to the cells. But it's only with a randomized controlled trial that we'll really be able to make a true comparison. If it turns out once you do the randomized study that this works, will yeah. this be the quote unquote miracle treatment that we're looking for? No, no, no. The miracle treatment will be a vaccine. With income from their family jewelry business cut off, the Naranjos have fallen behind on rent. But Luis is focusing on getting stronger and gaining back the 25 pounds he lost at the hospital. <laughs> you said your wife cooks very well. <laughs> so that helps. And he also credits his doctors. Gracias. Mil gracias. A thousand thank yous for his recovery. For CBS This Morning Saturday, Adriana Diaz. And thank you to all of those medical professionals doing so much to help so many.